Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV Blind. We're doing thumb turn stuff. At least that's kind of the idea. Set of posse. That right here? Yep. Level 10. Time Church Quest. Let's see. All these guys still here. Got the new staff here. It's one handed again. I don't know if we prefer the one handed or two handed. We have options, I suppose. It's technically better. Eh, we'll see. Guildmaster Kokobuki wishes you to learn from the second chapter of Thaumaturgy, The Yawning Abyss. Sounds like a plan to me. Yes, Artic? Yes. The aura of power surrounding you is palpable. The glare begins, begins to blind my Thaumaturgy's eye. We are level 10. <laughs> Your lesson today shall be taught by Koko Bahani. Go to him and hear from the chapter entitled The Threat of Possidy. I... Right over here. Ah, so, Artic, you have come to learn at the foot of the third eldest brother, have you? I promise you, however, your education shall not be third rate. Let's read from the second chapter, shall we? Are you settled? No last moment trips to the privy? Very well. The threat of paucity. Ah, how magnificent the ruthless power we wield. Flame devours, ice and tombs, and lightning courses through the stricken bodies of our foes. But oh, such desperation when the wellspring runs dry. Flame sputters out, ice melts into slush, and lightning sparks no longer. Know you this threat, and mind you the limits of your mortal vessel. A terrifying thought, isn't it? A thaumaturge who has exhausted his arcane reserves is not but a man with a stick and a funny hat. For we mages, you may as well equate the etheric energy flowing through our veins with our very lifeblood. Should a battle find us lacking in this precious resource, we are as good as dead. Controlling the expenditure of your power requires an understanding of etheric balance. The scales can tip in one of two directions, astrally or umbrally. When your mind and spirit lean in an umbral direction, your thaumaturgy is affected by a state known as umbral ice. The potency of your spells is diminished, but they also require less energy to invoke. On the other hand, a Thaumaturge in the Astral Fire state will find the potency of his incantations enhanced, but a greater cost to his etheric stamina. Now, if the concepts of etheric balance and efficient casting foremost in your mind, then you go forth and slay eight efts. Pray you your, do your best to stay alive. Looks badly on me when the mauled corpse of my one of my pupils is returned to the ossuary. Yeah, that would do it. We kind of already have the idea here. It's, it is sounding like a, there was a different system pri previously. They're talking like being in umbral ice only decreases when it actually makes it zero and also restores mana. No, I don't know. Where are Fs? You're in central Thanalan. Still burn here. <laughs> <laughs> also check out to see what kind of level quests are in this area. Be something to do. I think there's still there's like level ten ish quests over in the other section. Thanalan. Heading up norther than we were. Probably just wanna do the class quest first, get our new equipment. And then use that to more effectively succeed. Anything even out here? It really doesn't look like it. Got various fates and stuff. There's the materia guys. It doesn't look like there's any quests here. Maybe we did them. I don't know. <laughs> what I do know. There you go. On Chocobo back. We have to the enemies we're facing. Over right here. Or we can fight some other things. Which are also required. Stand back. And blast him. 
They're a whole five, though. But we're not gonna have any problems here. Let's go. It is definitely not quick attacks here. I guess the thunder is pretty quick. That's pretty much it, though. We only need to fight three of these. That is a hunting log complete. Okay, so. Oh, we got a sun bath there, too. That is a effective enemy to face. Right, we need to get some mana back here. Good. Bonk with the stick. This thunder bat over here. Sun, sun bat. Use thunder on the bat. Awesome. Weave in some staff snacks, I guess. Could be worse. Switch. And fire. We really don't seem to get interrupted at all either. We get interrupted by us running away. That's pretty much it. Got some animal skins. As much as moving out of the way of things would probably be wise, it also slows our damage down, so. <laughs> it's all right. Yeah, this one. Place back here. More sun bats. Let's go. This little camp back here. Lost hope. Wild. Everybody's chill. Let's just squatter this place. Concerns the old ones not. And those who flocked to help at first, only Father Illuid has remained steadfast. Hmm. That's like a place that would be a thing. Stuff's happening back here. There's not much happening out here, apparently. Yeah, whatever. We got more... F to slay. Two more, specifically. Okay. 
essen. Dann die Rebo. Und dann noch Feier. Das for free here. That'll work. Easy enough. We got our new staff. See if it sees that the one-handed staff is better and Otto gets a shield going. It's very possible. Let's just see which piece of equipment we want to take for the reward here too. Let's see, recommend anything new? Nope. We got this new robe recently. We got some legs. We're on the run. So I have a level 14 quest in here we could do at some point. Probably when we're level 14. That makes sense. Can use the Ethernet. It's fine. <laughs> On the run. Very good. Turn this in here. The next one's not going to be until level 15. That's basically how this works. I'm sure she's killed. Oh, come on. We have learned the thing. Aha! You arrived before me, upright and breathing. Wonderful. It's so much simpler to pose questions to a student without having to resort to necromatic divination. Tell me, Artic, what action would you take if you found your thaumatological endurance exhausted in the midst of battle? Brandish my scepter as a club or flee. I mean, we literally don't run out of mana. That's not the... We, we would cast the blizzard spell. <laughs> what would you do? Would, would smack with the club. Yes, the scepter is certainly a lethal instrument of death. Your death, you valorous fool. Remember the first chapter. We're not close distance with our enemies. We certainly not hit them with our finely crafted tools of thaumaturgy. Pretty consider replenishing your energies with a vial of ether before humiliating yourself in melee combat. Ah, ether. The draught of the gods. We thaumaturges, indeed any who practice the arts of arcane manipulation, Value this substance above all others. Thus, it was with unbridled fury that we received the most recent report of Beastman activity. Seems the, as Halja raiding party has attacked a caravan of the trade routes and made off with an entire crate of precious ether. The time has come for you to put your knowledge to the test. Annihilate these Halja bandits and retrieve the cargo of ether filled vials. According to the report, their armored war transport was last spotted to the south of Dryboat. Ah, uh, I believe Kokobuki has an additional request. While you're busy incinerating Hamolja, be sure to collect some samples of their blood. See if you can draw any from their smoking remains. Pretty fine to me. We do have some ether here. There it is. It's something. Restores a small amount of MP. Sure. <laughs> not, not really an issue here. Alright, this is Eastern Thanaland. Got some stuff happening there. Teleport. <laughs> it's so nice just having the teleports. It really works. <laughs> here we go. 
see if there's any quests out here. I think we should see quests that are higher level. Because we could switch to the other classes and be a higher level. So it's information that would be relevant to us one way or another. Oh. Up here. Oh yeah, there's lots of stuff out here. 17, 18, 24, 19. Looks like about 17 here. Also, labs is also an option. 17 over here. And nothing in the central, I guess. There's like 10 up here near Horizon, I guess. There's also Southern Thanalan. We've never even gotten down here, so that is higher level. And Northern Thanalan. Also, I haven't gotten up that way before. Well, it was higher level at one point, at least. On something. Alright. Head south of here. That's good. On the As far as unlocking things, all we have is the left quest here. Well, that's alright. Here is a car here. It's an armored war transport. Very impressive. Since a hostile presence. Is that a stand there? Your funeral. Fire. Should die from the lightning. There you go. Investigate. Got the blood. Investigate again. We got the crates. So it's still here. That's good. Alright. Problem solved. Can't cast return. But we could cast teleport. To Ona, Seth Held, 140. Check the map. It's probably how much it costs. Yep, yeah, 140. Worth it. You yeah, can't really quest out here just yet. As we learned before, if we take a higher level quest, we can't turn it in. Which is a shame. <laughs> Do some more difficult challenges, get rewarded for it. Not how it works. That's alright. There's no shortage of experience. Just go around doing all the different things. <laughs> We're gonna use this this time though. Hey, Ethernet. Thumbter skill. Very simple. Very good. I don't know. It says only a small amount of MP that it restores. It'd have to be pretty significant, because we just restored ourselves. So. Ah! It's definitely something. Turn this in here. And get our new stuff. Unless there's a third part of this trial here. There could be. Do I detect the scent of ether? I trust that stench is how much of blood. Oh yeah. Here's the blood. Malodorous lifeblood is so dark a red, it almost appears black. And a sturdy wooden crate filled with bottles of ether and copious amounts of packing hay. Don't want, don't want them to be broken. Obviously. Oh, 10 vials, 20, 30. So I have so much ether. It's just so very comforting. What have we here, Kokovani? Is this the crate that was stolen? I see Artek's lessons had the desired effect. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'll assume the vial. Viscous liquid you have there is Beastman blood. Coco Bussy should be pleased. Hey, he's back. Coco Pookie left word for me to visit the ossuary. Have you finally decided to begin my training in Thaumaturgy? Ah, Coco Bussy. 
good of you to come. Our chick here was kind enough to obtain a supply of Hamalja blood for you. An alchemist acquaintance of mine explained how you had been using the substance in your research to create a mana amplifying elixir. Ooh. Naturally, we are most interested in the results of such experiments. You see, Bussy, your work as an alchemist already puts you in a position to work alongside us. You need to become a thaumaturge to be part of our family. That's right, Bussy. Besides, the battlefield is a dangerous place, and our skills are not exactly suited to keeping others safe from harm. Well, with all the explosions and stuff, yeah. I see. This is but another attempt to dissuade me from pursuing my true calling. I do not want to cheer you on from the safety of my workbench. I want to fight at your side. But see, we just cannot stand the thought of you being harmed. Pray, do not do anything foolish. He's gonna do something foolish. <sighs> I do apologize, brother. Sometimes forget how difficult it must be not having a natural aptitude for the arcane arts. As I mentioned before, Arctic, you must see, is dangerously unsuited to the wielding of thaumaturgy. Even with proper training, he'd be unable to cast magics as we can. Were he to attempt to force a manifestation of power, the strain on his etheric reserves would, liter would likely kill him. But let's not dwell on that unpleasant circumstance. For you, on the other hand, are brimming with thaumaturgic potential. When diligent in your studies, do not cease in your efforts to expand your wellspring of power. Yeah. He's not going to appreciate that. <laughs> we get a copper scepter. A new sense. Ten the better. Let's compare how good they are. Plus two, plus three. No leg options. Eh. They're all about the same. I'd rather have a hat than a coif. Some gloves. Some boots. It's only plus one. Take the new body, I guess. All kinds of robes. Look great. Alright. Next quest level 15, of course. Let's see our new threads here. Well, yep, we're putting back on the square maple shield. <laughs> we could probably get a better shield somewhere. Yeah, we still have the starting legs here. Oh well. Equipment. Not quite as impressive as Dynamitica. We are all out of whack here. <laughs> Got another tiny stick <laughs> and a little shield. <laughs> I definitely say the two-hander looks better on us. <laughs> That's alright. Alright. Next thing I want to try to do here. Let's open up the hunting log. See where we're at. We're going to go to Western Thanalan, Central Thanalan, Central Thanalan. We get all those done easily enough. And maybe while we work on that, try queuing for some of these. Let's go to the guild tests here. We got the bonus experience and money for these. Just the easy level 10 stuff. Shouldn't be too long, in theory. We're still on the travel server business. Did you get a message saying that we should at least try to go back to the regular server. So I'll probably try that here next time. Really depends on how the server being full and queue times and all that are going. We will see. If we go to the hunting log here. Western Thanalan, Hammerlia, and Central Thanalan, the Black Rush. Let's go to the Western Hemerlia. Why not? Up here. Western. Really is right here. We could probably just take it from this exit. That'd be fine. Let's get to the 
It's in the commission, you know. Out to Western Thailand. Let's see here. Does help that the starting hunting logs are just in the area. So you don't have to travel all the world the first couple levels here at least. Alright. Apparently around here somewhere. Both of these. Yep. Looking for Yarsan beaters. These guys are typically more in the water. I think. I'll try to head down that way. Also, I'm looking for anything else. We also have like the other. Yes. Oh, let's. Come on, Sid. Let's get in here. Defeat it instantaneously. As long as the other person clicks accept. There's always the other. Yep, there it goes. Other DPS. <laughs> waiting around. Might be more waiting. Die so quickly we can barely even hit him. <laughs> Into here. And the sing spawns. Let's take out the big guy. <laughs> Fire! Fire! <laughs> Okay, rare cause three. There you go. That was do a whole bunch of these. All right. Accommodations, everybody. I think it's accommodations. Go for it. Bonus, 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 bonus. Level up. Eat. And we'll leave. These are really, really quick. <laughs> it's They're just so easy, you really do not learn anything. You get the idea that there might be something to learn, but honestly, not really. And join one specific one here. Getting down this way. This up here, this is more of a different spot. It really is up this way. Maybe. Could go down there. Oh, here's some. These are the right ones? Yes, they are. Level 5, guys. How do you like your chances against some fire? Three of these. Is enough. And one more. There you go. 980 XP for that. Most, most, most. And more money, too. Only two more things left on to do this whole thing. Both the, the Black Brush of Central Thailand. That is right up here near Black Brush Station. That's not too surprising. So we have two DPS ready. No tanker healer. Typical. <laughs> Someday we're gonna be in the tanker healer role. 
to keep on trying all these different classes. That'll be something. That'll be something. Okay. We are looking for here shell sweepers and swim grave robbers. Specifically. Up this way. Probably. I'm not sure anything that has the little mark. This is the bonfire that can be there. Just in this general vicinity. You can get around nice and quick with the jungle here. Got some ant guys. And we're towards the dungeon here. Give me an ant dungeon. Get attacked. I believe. <laughs> Antlings. Comets! Keep running while we wait for a few seconds. Looks like it. Drink this. There we go. Light party. Heavy party sometime. Even just a regular party. Yeah. This is not the lesson that you should be learning. You just not care. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Used all of our mana. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Come in. Everybody. Turn it. Bonus, 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 bonus. Is this that? <laughs> all right, now we're back out. There's all of the those that we can do for now. A little bit out of the path here. Oh, here's some rats nest. There we go. Mm, fire for you. Thunder. It's really difficult to stay out of melee range when your spells take this long to cast and you don't have any like, freezes or anything. Or any stuns. I guess we can put them to sleep. But like, they're just gonna wake up immediately, so. Yeah. Fire there immediately. Man. All right. Join the feet. All right now. 
We got one more hunting line to do. Grave robber. Find a grave. Be where they would be. Hmm. Down here somewhere. This little track here. That just goes. Looks like nowhere. Blocked off. Shame. Of course, we can't just jump over these little fences here. No entry. Oh. Well. <laughs> these are not the guys we're looking for. Far away from the exact spot it says Black Brush here. As long as it's not the basin or the clutch here, should be the area. There's some. There we go. These guys down here. A little ways away from where it says, but it's just the whole area. That's okay. Alright. I'm gonna light him on fire. Unfortunately, the fire doesn't actually light him on fire. It's just a big attack. Let's whack him. Yes, we can. Honestly, just whacking him with the stick saves us on MP, so. I don't know. It's a pretty good strategy to me. Questionable. When it works, it works, I suppose. Stand in melee distance. Thank it. And we Difficulty rank unlocked. Level up. Level 8 complete. Level rank 1 complete. There you go. I think this is level 13. I can totally do some quests now. Easy enough. Western Thailand, Central Thailand, Central and Western Thailand, Western and Central Thailand, Eastern Thailand, at higher level. Alright. This is Central Thailand. Give me some stuff out here. I think we want to go back to doing some just regular quests. And that's going to be currently over in Western Thailand. The lowest level in the other section was like 17. So we want to get to 15, do the level 15 quest for the Thaumaturge Guild. And then get over that way. Okay. Oh, yeah. Should be at least a few things to do over here. Let's see right here. Well, 10 quests. And 17 also over here. 4750. Not really as many quests. Could always go and do dungeon stuff. I think we're all. Can we actually do that? That's a question. We want to go into. Uh, Duty support. Insufficient level. We need to be at least level 15 to actually start here. We, to we could totally do it right now, but it needs to be level 15. That's fine. So we can't do a dungeon. We do like a guild test or something. Guild test. Lev met. We already did the guild pests. We do a Lev mets. Through these places. See what's going on in Southern Thailand. That seemed like that was the higher level. Even Northern Thailand. Go after some more of the hunting logs. A bit more XP. Just get XP for fighting stuff too. We also could be using the get more XP stuff, but it's only like 
3%. Only for fighting. And we don't really fight a huge amount of things either. Could be something. We could definitely end up making some of those with cooking and stuff, so. I don't think it's a huge deal. Do the quests around here. Figure out a way to 15 if that doesn't accomplish it. We can continue the Thumpshire stuff. More guild hests, dungeons, hunting logs, regular quests, left mets, just fighting things. There's many options. Next time. Good.